Hello and welcome to another Mine vs Craft video. Now in this video I will be filming a creation from Celadon Leader 32, which is an amazing armor stand swapper. But to get there we need to go through this 3x3 three three with a hole in the middle piston door. Okay, now, if I press this button, the armor stands will swap. There's only two in here, but it was designed completely from scratch by Celadon Leader. So, if I press it, we can see that one drops down and the other one hops back up. And it works in quite quick succession, although don't spam it as it will get broken. Like so. But, what I want to show you is not more of this incredible armor stand swapper, it's how to build it. And to do that, we're going to need a few resources. Okay, now welcome back. I have built a model here for you to copy on, a lot easier to follow than this, which was inside a building. Here we will see the resources needed. We don't necessarily need exactly exactly 64 blocks of iron, but you just need some blocks to serve there. Uh, as you can see, you need six observers, two repeaters, two armor stands, four pieces of redstone dust, one sticky piston, one slime block, one iron trapdoor, one button, and of course the blocks, for which I'm using blocks of iron, but most people building this on a survival world will want a much less expensive choice. Okay, so now we're going to have a look around. Here we can see our full redstone dust. And that is coming from this button. This is being powered from here, which then co goes into here, which goes above this observer triggering it. And then this observer sees this one and gets triggered. This observer sees this one and so on. And that sends down a very quick and easy way to get the signal down, which then powers this block powering this one tick, remember one tick of then um, repeater, which goes into this, which obviously then bounces this up. Then we have this part. This is here, and um, we have this two tick. I think it can be three tick or four tick, but it just can't be one tick. And what we're going to do now is we are going to press this button. And we can see we have our armor stand swapper right there for us. And things where you might go wrong if you have that on two, uh, if say I put this on two ticks and it is too late, the trap door has already closed, there's no time left for it to go back up, so that's one mistake you might make. Another mistake you might make is you might accidentally turn this on to one tick, in which, similar to the last one, there won't be enough time for anything else to happen because that has just happened so insanely quickly. So two ticks, three ticks or four ticks is good for that. And this block is not necessary. However, it does prevent it from going much higher. So yeah, that's how to make a very simple, like extremely simple armor stand swapper in Minecraft Bedrock using actually very few resources. This was all built by Celadon Need 32. I'm just here to make the video on it. But I hope you've enjoyed. If you want to see more of Celadon Leader's incredible redstone builds, make sure to leave a like on this video and you will definitely see more of them. He is a mad scientist, basically, and he comes out with great results. So, I hope you have enjoyed. Thank you, and goodbye.